I'm so excited. Next up on our tour is a history of the gay parades. Oh, if you don't lay off the haagen you could be afloat in next year's gay parade. You are one to talk, Miss One Size Fits All Sweatpants. But there's one thing I don't know. Just one thing? Well, the one thing I don't know is how the parade got started. I have a feeling some queens were so high and drunk one night, they just stumbled on the street and started a parade. Not even close, sister. The first gay parade started as a reaction to the Stonewall Rebellion of 1969. Well, of course it did. I knew that. What was Stonewall? Stonewall was the first time the gay community fought back against the police who routinely raided and arrested gay patrons of bars in New York City. What did the police arrest them for? For being gay. For being gay? Stonewall was the catalyst for gay liberation everywhere in the form of gay parades in our own country and around the world. Would you just stop yakking on and on and let me get back to running my tour? Well, if you knew anything about the topic... Well, what I was about to say was the very first gay parade was in Hollywood, uh-huh, on Hollywood Boulevard in 1970. That's not West Hollywood. Well, you ought to know you were there. Oh, yes, I went to the first gay parade in West Hollywood right after I witnessed the signing of the Declaration of Independence. Huh. I was not at the first gay parade. How old do you think I am? Well, now, let me see. That was a rhetorical question. Well, I know that, but you want an answer, don't you? Forget it. Just move on. Well, all right. Oh, but wait till I tell you the best parts about the West Hollywood gay parades. Of course you will. <laughs> <laughs> 